You know what, guys? <clears throat> Marissa told me not to, but I'm doing it anyway. About a year ago, I was invited to her cousin, Brittany, bitch, house. I went over there, I had a good time. You know, we're playing for Mori fucking Yahtzee bullshit. Then it starts to get crazy. He wanted me to go for a ride with them to go pick up one of their friends that I went to school with. She was going through a lot. I hope she's doing all right. Hi, you know who you are. But, uh, I got the car with him. You guys know he's a fucking drug addict. And Marissa and her mom are letting them watch my fucking son. Knowing he does fucking cocaine and I have proof of it. Because I was in that car and he had a little plastic bag, like a sandwich bag, with a straw. He, he, he put a line like that on the dashboard, took the straw, fucking snorted it, and they all called me a fucking liar. Oh, he was off drugs. I'm sorry. If he was off drugs, he wouldn't be fucking doing it, dumbass. This is the other fucking thing that's pissing me off. My son was bad over there, okay? But here's what they did. You know, when you have a kid, they want to go to bed, they want their little sippy cup to fall asleep, juice, milk, water, whatever the hell you give your kid, right? Her fucking boyfriend snatches it out of his fucking hand and throws it across the fucking floor. Marissa didn't say one fucking word. Her mom didn't say one fucking word about it. And then they put him in a corner, which is okay. Imagine this is a corner. They put him in a corner. Let me go get it. Not, it's not the same one, but they have this is my ROTC belt. It's not the same one, but they have like a leather brown belt. So let's say Landon's in the corner, okay? They put him in a corner, and they, they would threaten to hit him with the belt. But I could have sworn I'd seen him swing like this and hit Landon on the ass with the belt. And her mom and Marissa didn't see it, but I could have sworn I'd seen him fucking hit my fucking kid with the belt. And you're like, that motherfucker's hate with my, hey, watch my kid. Fuck's wrong with you? I'm on her grave side for that, and I can't stand that bitch. That family, I'm going to tell you something. If y'all ever do it, date Marissa, I'm going to tell you something. If we ever work, don't work out, we break up, they're psycho. They're drama. If anything don't go their way, they ain't having it. It's their way or no way. And if you want to date Marissa, you have to deal with her mom. And her mom's a fucking psychotic, mental case, anger issue bitch. Someone just needs to go up to her with a crowbar and just... Right in the fucking head. Get some fucking common sense in that bitch. Maybe not a crowbar, but knock her the fuck out. She keeps running her mouth one day. Someone out there... It's got to have enough and just pop her and just fucking pop her right in the fucking jaw. Like, come on, bitch. Come on, fuck up. And it's fucking uppercut that bitch. Sorry, I'm not in a fighting mood. I can do better than that. But that's what they're going to do. They're going to knock her out. They're going to knock her ass out. And they can't stand me. They never did. Fucking stupid. It's ridiculous. Don't ever fucking hit my son with a belt again, motherfucker. I'll call the police.